Hey, what's going on YouTube? This is James and Zoe with another episode of JTZ TCG, and we're bringing you something really special. If you've watched any of our episodes before, any of our pack openings, you've probably heard us mention we were huge fans of Ando from Unlisted Leaf. And one of the cool things that he does is he buys these custom packs from a company called Pokey Collect, and they make their own custom booster packs. And they can be anything from just straight up full arts, they can be anything but straight up hollows, and they're really cool custom packs. So today, we are gonna be opening up some of these custom packs. We have two of the combination V with hollows, we have nine of the full art with hollows and one of the really special one, my favorite one that I've watched Ando open is the full art God pack. You're guaranteed to get nothing but full arts in that pack. It's about $30, $30, $40, but it's so worth it. And he opened some of these recently on one of his videos not too long ago. And they've even incorporated Champion's Path into these packs. So there is a chance, a chance that we could get the Darkness Ablaze Full Art Charizard VMAX. There is a chance that we could get the Shiny Charizard V Full Art. So anything tops the limit with these custom packs. Let's get into it and see what we pull. All right, we're gonna start off with the V with holo card combination. We have two of these and we're gonna go ahead and get them opened up. And like I said, make sure you check out their store. Poke Collect always has some awesome items. Here recently they had such a big spurge of purchases that they were out of stock for just a brief moment. Uh, but they are back in stock. I did receive an email that uh, they were back in stock of their products. So again, make sure you check them out. They're super cool. Oh, let's see, there we go. Lucario, hollow rare, and all shinies throughout the rest of that. And now with these, we pull them out. And if you've watched any of Ando's videos before, we take the front one and we move it to the back and we get a hollow rare Corvid Knight and flip it around. And we get a Galarian Stun Fist V. So not bad, not bad. Got a bunch of guaranteed hollows and then the Stun Fist V. We have another one of these packs. We're going to get into it. And when Ando opens these, Poke Collect does specifically mark them for certain things. Pack 1, Pack 2, Japanese All-Stars, Japanese God Packs, and etc. Um, when you do your order, they don't number them like that. They do put them in order. Ooh, Chip Chip Ice Axe. That's pretty good. Oh, look at that Gyarados from Dragon Majesty, the Blaziken, and the Hollow Rare Mudsdale. They do put them in the order of uh, how they ship them to you. So, and I'm pretty sure I've got these ordered how uh, I ordered them for us to open. So we get the Hollow Rare Chandelure and we flip it over and we get the more Pico V. So not bad, not bad. Now we are getting in to the cool stuff. We have nine of these full art combination hollow packs and again champion's path is in this some of these packs if you've watched any and his videos so there is a chance that we could pull a shiny charizard v there is a chance we could pull the darkness ablaze full art charizard v max so we're gonna turn these around oh man aggie slash ex team rockets handiwork and the Rapier V, okay? That was just the bait, the start of it. Let's get in to the special stuff here. Here we go. So, flip this to the back, and we get a Butterfree V Max from Darkness Ablaze. And turn this around, and we get an Eternius, or Eternatus V Max. Super sick. That is a way to start a full art pack. That is pretty cool. That is pretty cool. All right, now moving into the next one. Man, that, that first one was just that good. I can't wait to see what the other eight have to bring. So here we go. Set this down, get into the pack first, and turn them over, and we get the Snorlax, Weezing, 
and Naha. Oh, you know what, guys? I think I kind of fudged. So this one was actually our full art God pack. So this was the full art God pack that we got. We had one of these, and that was our full art God pack. But still, that's pretty sick uh, for the God pack. So it did look like I got the order wrong on those. And the rest of these are still full arts, but they're in combination with the hollows. So we're going to get to that. And pull these out. And take it to the back. And we get a Kabalion. And turn it over. And the promo Eternatus V. Check that out. That is super cool. So Eternatus V with the Kabalion from Fates Collide. Super cool. All right, and we get into the next pack. Set this to the side. See what our hollow rares are. Turn them over. We get a Jolteon from Hidden Fates, Erica's Hospitality, and the Lucario from Ultra Prism. And let's check out what our full art is. Take this, put it to the back. So we do get a Zygarde from uh, Champion's Path and turn it around. And a full art Stone Journer V. Check that out. Super cool. Super cool. And set those to the side. These are custom packs are just so amazing. That's what made me really want to get some after seeing Ando open them for the last couple times. Being guaranteed a full art, being guaranteed hollows and shinies is super sick. It, Brock's training and the Cartana, it's just super cool because as much as I love pack openings, they can be very disappointing sometimes when you don't even get the hollow rare out of the pack. Ooh, Victini, very nice. And you can find mines and flip it around. And then with our Stone Journer V, we get the V Max to go with it awesome and there's no guarantee like getting this many full arts in a row i mean just check out all the these hits right now that that's super sick i mean we've got some over here in this stack let's you know put the more pico over there let's put the stun fist v over there and i mean just check this out and we still have i don't know five six packs left to go and we've got all these hits so far that's just amazing. These packs are super cool. I can't wait to get some more. Like I said, Poke Collect was out of stock on their merchandise for a little bit. They actually just opened uh, an in-person store where you can go shop at also for their products. So congrats to Poke Collect from taking that milestone and getting location open. But definitely check out their website. Their, their mystery boxes are super cool. These packs are super cool. Shaman, very nice. And turning around, and we get in Denny V with that healing ability for watch over. Very nice. One of the things I do want to get, they, I believe the last time I checked, and just because Pokemon has exploded in the market right now, is they do offer some custom vintage packs also. I would like to order maybe uh, two, three, four, or five of those just to kind of see what I get from the nostalgic packs from back when I used to collect uh, back then. And we turn it over, and now we get the promo Raichu GX. Very nice. And uh, I would like to just get some of those vintage packs. I think they would be super cool to get some of those cards from back in the day when I was a kid, like Zoe and Trey, you know, and them kind of look at some of the cards I used to get from back in the day, you know, maybe even possibly pull the Charizard, you know. From, oh, Garboder with that Garbotoxin. That's very nice. Uh, the Charizard from back in the day from base set. You never know that, that that's a potential pull in those custom packs. All right. Take it around. We get a Latios. And we get an Entei GX now from Shining Legends. Very nice. Check that full art out. Set that to the side. We've got three packs left, guys. Three packs. We are just turning and torching through these things right now. 
There we go. Hollows, we get a Polyrath, a Cartana, and then the Victory Bell from Celestial Storm. I mean, and just, you put the full arts aside, look at all these shiny cards. Look at all these shiny cards. You're not guaranteed that in regular packs. You're not guaranteed that. that that's super sick. Don't get me wrong, Pokemon Company, love regular packs. I like the chase factor, but it's nice to get guarantees every now and then after you do so much chasing. So we do get the Heat Ran from Darkness Ablaze, and we flip it, and we get an alternative art than Denny GX. You can only get this out of the Pokemon Trainer's Toolkit or trade it for somebody who didn't want it. The alternative art with the squishy cheeks. Cheek, 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 cheek. So cool. Reminds me of Zoe's cheeks when I get to pinch her cheeks. No. <laughs> All right, second to last pack. Second to last pack. That Den Denny was pretty sweet. Pretty sweet. Den Denny still huge, especially now. Uh, ooh, oh, that's the Evolutions Farfetch. That's pretty cool. And then Alteria from Dragon's Majesty. Den Denny is going to be super huge, along with Crobat V, even more so now. Um, if y'all have not heard, Pokemon has updated their uh, ban list for expanded. And Shaman EX is officially banded, I believe, at the end of November. So Shaman EX will go into the Museum of Nostalgic Remarkable EXs from back in the day. Oh, man, and a Gardevoir Full Art EX from Steam Siege. One of the very few cards that were worth getting out of that expansion. That's super cool. But, so if you have any Shamans... AEX is on hand, either get them graded if they're not too heavily played, which most of them are, uh, or you better sell them off fast because the price points are going to drop off pretty quick. All right, here's our last pack, guys. We get a Rhyperior, an Arbok, and a Slack King, and let's see what we get in our last one. Here we go. So, take this to the back. Ooh, we get a Landorus. Very nice. That that art looks pretty cool. And we turn it around. And we get a Celestial GX from Ultra Prism. Not bad. Not bad. So, let's check them out. Just do a quick recap. You know, we get the Celestial, the Gardevoir, the Denny. That's huge. And Tay, Raichu. And Dene, the Galarian Stunfisk, a Morpico, a Stone Journer V, Stone Journer V Max, the Alternative Eternatus V, a Butterfree V Max, an Eternatus V Max, a Rapierier V, a Team Rocket's handiwork. That art is super cool. And then the Aggie Slash EX al Alternative Art. Super cool. Just a bunch of hits out of those custom packs. That's super cool. And not to mention just the stack of reverse and hollows. That's super cool. Oh, that's so awesome. Those packs were super sick, guys. I hope you enjoyed the video. I know I enjoyed Pokey Collect. I definitely am going to be ordering some more of these packs in the future to open up on the channel. Uh... I'm not disappointed at all with any of the pulls. Some of them were pretty great, I'm not going to lie. You know, the Den Denning, you know, Chee Chee Chee. So, <laughs> no. Yeah, because no. reminds me of Cheeky over here. No. <laughs> but uh, make sure you check Pokey Collect out. I'll put a link in the description below of the video so you can check out their products. Make sure you go hit them up, get some of those custom packs again. They got all kinds of stuff. Uh, mystery boxes, English set, Japanese sets, you know, just amazing product in the store. Again, I'll put that link in the description below. And please make sure you subscribe to our channel, like the video, hit us up, get us, us some love, and be on the lookout for video, uh, future videos. We do have a, another video coming out for our one last, last, last chance of trying to get that rainbow rare uh, Charizard VMAX out of Champion's Path. I know I've said 
last twice, you know, three times the charm. So we're going to make one last attempt out of the Charizard VMAX. And later, we will also be debuting Shocking Volt Tackle, or as we know it, Vivid Voltage, with our own in-house pre-release style tournament. If you've seen any of our previous videos, we are, uh, love doing these tournaments at home. We're forced to, unfortunately, because of COVID, but it's still a lot of fun. The matches are a lot of fun. The pulls are great to see to look at the new cards, so make sure you don't miss out on that. This is James, and this is Zoe coming from you from JTZ TCG. Gotta catch them all, guys.